all Sandman today, but it's Sandman Saturday, right? And I would love to just climb and maybe hit infinite someday again. Marvel's Muffin. All right, we could do this. I don't, I never like playing one drops on, on Mojo World. But with Doom, like Mojo World's a good location for us, I think. RF, do it. <laughs> um, you mean you're gonna do it like now? Or you're thinking about it in the future? Because here's, this is my thought. Um, okay, are you, do you generally stream stuff? All right, it's the, it's the KM deck again. Onslaught Citadel is pretty bad for us. Um, and pretty good for them. So we're gonna have to Scarlet Witch it before this is all done. Okay, good. I was gonna say, um, I've had people come in and be like, yeah, I, I think I'm going to start streaming. And the, the best advice that I have is to just do it now and don't don't wait. Um, I mean, I don't literally mean this exact second, but. Mm, man, we're not going to have time, though. But we're just going to lose if we don't do it. This might just have to be a retreat. But 96 right now, definitely trying to hit infinite today. It's an interesting choice. So we can do this. Wait, hold on though. Do we feel like it's a guarantee that that's what they're going to do? Because if we just Eliath right, we're good to go. We could do this as well. I don't know. I feel like I feel like this is a good call. Wait, I just ran ads. I don't need ads to start again. What are you talking about, computer? Yeah, this feels good. Um, that's a bummer. And them thinking this long doesn't give me confidence in our choice. I guess we'll see. Oh, and Project, Project Yodi, Project Yachty. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. They have to fill for Ant-Man. That's true. But I think it depends on, like, if they play blue... Oh, okay. If they play blue Marvel or they play something else. Yeah. All right. I'm glad I didn't snap. That didn't feel good for us. We don't have that far to go. We should be able to do this. My goal is to be home. It's almost 1 o'clock here. I want to be home by 2 if possible. Or be done streaming by two. So we'll see if we can make that happen. Jola. Like the like IJOs? Is that you? Uh so I stream from Oh, we gotta do this though. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that. I stream from school. Um from my classroom. Mainly because uh, in the mornings, before school is when I have the opportunity to actually like make videos. So, yeah, I am a teacher. 
I teach high school special ed. Apocalypse. Alright, we don't we don't fare well against discard most of the time. Although wave isn't it's not a bad it's not a bad card right now. But Magneto can mess up their plans pretty good. So we gotta hope that uh hope that we can get some good draws here. Ms. Marvel feels almost necessary. Oh, never mind. It's a swarm one. If we can get Sandman, we're just good to go. I think we're okay. Yeah, so uh, I talked about it earlier, but we should get 7 to 12 inches of snow um, where I live. Starting in a little bit. Um, so if I have a snow day on Monday, which seems incredibly likely at this point, uh, I will have... No, not Northeast. <laughs> um... I'll have a I'll do a stream on Monday as well. Doom isn't that helpful right now, but um it spreads out power. Oh, this sucks though, because we really, really wanted Sandman to make this work. I'll lock this in. Um, getting a foot where uh, you are. Yeah. So I live. Um, I live in New Mexico, and so getting this much snow is a little bit strange, but it's pretty exciting. I'm I'm good with it. We just did we win? Heck yeah! Victory! Hooey! Yep. Uh, Trey Boss Fu, that sounds relatively familiar. Not quite at the border, but it's probably the same storm. <laughs> Dude, I, I freaking love, I love Sandman. And I love that you can win with Sandman even if you don't draw Sandman. Camertage is great. I mean, if we get Doom, we just fill up the whole board with Dooms, maybe. We'll see. Clever boy. We got Doom. So, the way I'm feeling this one, ooh, Onslaught Citadel could work out well as well. Well as well. Mm hmm. All right. We're doing Electro. So we're going to go Sandman now. And again, the idea with this like choice right now is doing a Sandman deck when Leech and all of that nonsense is everywhere. If they want to spend their fifth turn playing Leech, that's up to them. But I, I feel like we'll be okay if that's what they choose to do.
And I hope this doesn't seem ridiculous. But Doom... Yep, good. Into Ms. Marvel right. Seems pretty good. I don't know if it's if it's good enough, but it seems pretty good. Seventeen on the right, and then eighteen mid. They could drop a Hulk, and who knows? Maybe they they have a massive Hulk. Heck yeah. Yeah, I think Magneto... Magneto would have been fine too. Um, we just don't have him. Or are you saying they... Them play Magneto? He's very similar to a deck I'm running. That Hulk came out late for him. Yes, it does. <laughs> or, sorry, yes it did. Um, I feel like I've had that kind of luck. Pretty, uh... Pretty recently. Honestly, Elias, Eliath was probably the... Yeah, that's true, too. Just... When I can do... Ooh. We think a bot? That's a pretty cool variant, though. messing around with a bunch of different high evo decks i love high evo this is 100 percent in my personal unbiased opinion probably a bot i prefer Eliath players that aren't Eliath brained the card is super toxic don't need to be a a timmy power gamer to boot bot boot you said boot rf said bot got it I, I Evo junk seems incredibly mean. Seems like you could get some stuff done. Okay, how do we uh, how do we sandbag into this? Wait till they snap and then snap back. Dang it, I screwed it up. We don't wanna, you don't want priority in, uh, okay. All the rules, man. Can't keep it straight. Doom? Or does Doom make them retreat? We have Pryo though. Didn't get Sandman out. Dang it. Victory. Ugh. Look at these plays, man. Angela mid on turn five. Ugh. That sucks. All right. Well, we're super close. I'm not... I'm not worried about it. All right, so hold on. Explain the strategy to me. You wait. You wait until they snap on turn four or five. Make sure that they have priority going into the final turn, and then you just... That's it. That's what you do? That's how it's supposed to work? 
I don't think I said it, but uh, the KG one. Thank you for the follow. What did I lose? Oh, they lost. Okay, I thought. Never mind. We're okay here. Jeffrey. Okay. All right. I'll see. I mean, this person seems pretty real to me. That's how it does work. It could be close, but as long as they lead in two lanes, they stay. All right. And then we go Sandman right. These are not good draws. Like, we've got Electro Sandman, but we don't have Doom. Don't have a lot of stuff. Uh, you don't have Jeff. So Jeff works for a variety of reasons. Um, so he's pretty tough to replace, but... Um, for the purposes of this deck... Eh. Lizard, Medusa, Nightcrawler, if you want to use a different one drop. All right. So they have Infinite. Silk could be fun. The only problem with Silk is that if Silk lands on Scarlet Witch's lane, then you don't get the, uh, the Ms. Marvel buff. That should be it. All right, they left. <laughs> How do you generally identify bots? I've still not figured that out. Well, I suck at it, apparently. But usually they have, like, a pretty standard person name. Like Jeff. Or John. Um, or Travis. And their uh, avatar is a very standard one, I think, too. Um, but someone said the other day, like, their decks are the same. Like, they just look the same. So, I don't know. Bizarre name. Or a bizarre name, like that one. <laughs> Uh-oh. Okay, all right, all right. What deck do you use to counter high Evo? Are you playing against high Evo with a pool two deck? Explain that one to me. How did that happen? Yeah, I don't I don't even know that it's like well it, they don't feel synergistic, that's true. Um Yeah, interesting. Like they just A lot of times they make bad plays, which oh no. Ice freaking box. That's a pretty nice Mobius you got there. Bitwiller, you're calling this... Oh, you're, you're saying that's a good one. Uh, ongoing Destroyer with Storm. Counters high Evo with pool 2. Gotta go for power, I think. New the game. Two weeks and I see a lot of high Evo decks on this game and don't know how to fight back. Okay. Um, I got you. Wow. We're just, we're so screwed. If they snap, we leave. This is so bad. Yeah, I think if you... I just don't, I don't remember all the cards that are in pool two. Sarah. Y'all think this is a good uh, time to retreat, probably. Doom right would be the best we could do here. Reached level 5XX. Still have a lot of pool three cards, so... But do you think we can win with Doom?
Magneto left is also an option, but that still wins mid for them. I'll just do it. They should win, but, um, oh well. That's okay, we're pretty close. Sweet. Huh. That that didn't work out well, and I believe that that is us hitting 90. Whew. Heck yes. Yeah, so... Him July 37, thank you for the follow. I'm I'm thinking through your question. It's a it's a good question. I just I don't have a good answer because I I'm trying to think back to what I would have access to back then. <laughs> Bit, you gotta do this yourself, man. You could do it. You you make freaking cool decks. You know what you're doing. Way better than I do. Um Yeah, I, I think if you have, like, what what pool of three cards do you have access to? Let's start there. That'll make that'll make things a little bit easier to, to talk through, I think. Except there's a million pool of three cards, so that could be quite a list. Just behind, you've been stuck a bit between 83 and 88. Didn't play too much over Christmas, so ended up at 58 for the start of the season. Yeah. Hey. It's okay. All right, they're snapping because they're destroyed. Turn one snap, man. Bar is good. If it's destroy, this isn't going to help us out very much. Oh. Every time, man. That's such a bummer. Wind paid my hand. Bit you might have. I'm not sure. I didn't open Discord ahead of time, so I can't open it right now or else it'll make the game go away. How do we avoid bar, though? Please be a bunch of threes or something. Ooh. Yes. I'm I'm doing some math here. I'm doing some math here. And I am pretty excited about Magneto. I'm a little bit afraid because I I don't know what else to play. This I should just Odin, shouldn't I? I just, I wanted, I was going for style, man. You're right, though. Are ye worthy? Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> Odin is dirty here. Oh, sucks. I was just thinking, like, Magneto mid, but who knows how much they beat us on the right by, so it's very possible that that would have been a terrible call. But we just mitigated the play of four cards. That sucks. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, I also... Let me check stats quick, too. Yeah, we're 44 and 19 with this deck. And we're up 64 cubes. No, I do. I don't. I don't like doing that. <laughs> I <laughs> sorry, winning. It. I don't. Yeah, I don't know. I really don't hate Dream Dimension as long as we can get a few things out that we want out. But we'll see if we can do that or not. 
Ugh, daredevil. Dude, is it Icebox Day? What is this? This Marvel seems like she's going to be incredibly important. No, no, other order, sorry. Uh, so we go... Scarlet Witch. Yeah. Should be okay. Yeah, I... I, I have Eliath in here because he makes things work, but... I feel bad. Okay. Is this a bot? Don't have Sandman out. Is it just a Lyoth mid? No Doom, no Marvel. Oh, I don't think it's a bot. Yeah, Jeff can go anywhere. Um, you can play him into any location. Oh, hey, yeah, that's Jeff. So you can move him once per game, but you can play him on any location, um, including ones that you're not allowed to lay cards uh, in. So if a place is Professor x you could still lay Jeff in there. Um, yeah. I, also, I don't think I said this, but uh, just mitts. Maybe I did. Man, I'm so bad at this. Yeah, just just mitts. Thank you for the follow. So much going on. You can move it into Professor X as well, yeah. I don't like Machine World that much. I probably should have just gotten rid of Machine World instead of playing Jeff. Because I'd, I'd like to play Ms. Marvel there. Yeah. Th but that's why Jeff is so hard to replace. Okay. Yeah, you can play him as the wow, second card. So, yeah. That's one of the coolest things that you can do. That's not good for us, though. YOLO? So yeah, like if a game, if you get Electro out and a game goes to seven, let's say you have eight energy to spend on the seventh turn, you can play Eliath plus Jeff. Uh, if for some reason that would be the play that wins it for you. Um, ah, danger room. Hmm. So like they could play Jeff into their Professor X right now too. I'm just not, I'm not feeling, I'm not feeling this one.
I mean, if they snap, we bail. It's not a huge deal to me. We'll see if they want to continue playing. I think we might have them scared, but I, I believe that they have a really good shot to win. Jimbo. Let's just see. Hmm. It's all right. Not super stressed. Um. I do wish that like retreat later would last for 10 seconds and then just allow you to leave the game so that I don't have to put him through this much agony. I'm le I'm not I I'm not playing anything, man. You win. Escaped. <laughs> Goodness gracious. <laughs> okay. Sorry. I don't I don't love dragging that out I it it goes back to like so it's why I don't like playing a lieth it's why I don't love doing a lot of things in this game I don't like ruining the experience of playing a game for other people so I don't like ruining anything for other people um, and I'm I feel like I'm the most conscientious driver that's ever existed in the world I hate the idea that, like, I drive the speed limit. I don't mess around, okay? I, I don't want to get pulled over. I don't make that much money. I don't need a speeding ticket, okay? Ooh, bar. Hmm. This is a weird set of locations, though. But if I am driving the speed limit and someone else is a freaking speed demon, I feel bad for not going faster. <laughs> so I I don't I of course don't end up speeding heavily, but I do sit there and be like, oh, I bet this person hates me. I, I'm so bad. Like I just get in my own head while I'm driving everywhere. Anyway, it's a random thought. Um odd deck. I feel like this could be a bot. I mean, we made it very possible for them to Shang-Chi us, so Strange Academy allows Ms. Marvel to work right. I just needed one of their cards to go right, and then I would feel very confident. I don't, I don't, I don't think we can lose. I, it's possible, probably, but... There should be no way for them to win. Oh, I was worried about that one. Let's see. We freaking tied. Time. Dude. <laughs> oh, dang it, man. I like that one, though. I like that. That was fun. All right, Bit, what were you saying? Strange Academy allows Ms. Marvel to work right. How? Oh, to put her right. I got you. Okay. Interesting. I think... I mean, that would have probably allowed us to win. I mainly just wanted to cut off their options. That was a weird one, though. I don't know that I feel that that was a bot. It might just have been a, a strange deck. Yeah, 
it sends cards randomly, so whatever costs. Yeah. Um, absolutely. And I, I think I just... I tunnel visioned on Magneto. But it, it's interesting, like, discard decks running Shang-Chi. I guess it's necessary. There's so many big decks out there right now. Also, not seeing a lot of Sandman. We're not going wave. We don't want to give them the option to lay anything big. Okay. Timmy Power Gamer Mindset. In all fairness, Magneto is legit. I, I think Magneto is an amazing counter card in this game. Okay, so they have one of three, and um, what are they? Okay, so it's just a Loki deck. I, I, I'm going to think, but I, I talked about this before. I think this season of Marvel Snap is like what I was excited for. Because I do, I love just throwing down big cards. It goes with the, the barbarian that lives very deep in my soul. It's just been a rough season. Are you nuts? What am I going to do with that? Oh, retreat probably. Remy Fa Soul. Thank you for the follow. Face Soul. Oh, they also have buttloads of energy. No, we're out. What am I doing? I was trying to come up with a way that we could do that. Yeah, well, they they snapped on me, and... Whether they got a Lioth, Magneto, whatever it is. It's the day of hard to pronounce Twitch names. Hey, I agree. <clears throat> I, got, I got crap from my father-in-law. He said... One of my favorite things that I've heard from him. He's such a nice dude. Like, I love my father-in-law. But he he was like, so, uh, your podcast. First of all, not a podcast, but I'm not going to correct. Um, it's not, it doesn't help. Um, what do you, how often do you do it? It's like every, every day or so is, I try to put up, you know, something every day. Oh, Ego! And it is. Let's have some fun. Lamentous! <laughs> oh no. Um and he's like, wow, that's that's amazing. Every day. It's like, yeah, I'm I'm going for it, man. Oh. Guess so. Oh, we're gonna change the ego again. Oh, dude, that's hilarious. Oh victory. In my mind, I was seeing like Odin end up on ego. Yes. Ooh, yeah. And so he's like, okay, but what's the what's the name of your podcast? I was like, well, my YouTube channel, it, the name is, uh, is Fathor Newman. And then he sat there for five to ten minutes trying to type it out. And I was like, it's all one word. You just go on YouTube, you type that in, my face will be there. It's like, oh. Okay, I think I know what your problem is and why you can't make any money on YouTube. I was like, yeah, do you? 
It's like, your name is too difficult to type in. You should probably pick something easier so that people could find you. Then you'd be doing great. It's like, oh, thanks, man. <laughs> he means well, but uh, he's probably right. It's not, it's not that hard, I don't think. A uh, bit. The answer to that is no. <laughs> is he one of the nicest people on earth? Oh, yeah. But that's a bit of a struggle. It's all about being in the right place at the right time. All you can do is put yourself out there. Yeah. And it, I think also, if my goal. Woo wee! All right. Let's see what we could draw because we could totally win this. Um, I'm not like I'd, I'd love to make money consistently doing stuff like this it's not my biggest concern if it ends up happening awesome if it doesn't my main thing is I just want to make stuff um, I want to have stuff for my kids to go watch someday when I'm not around that's it I did announce I was going live today Incoming leech. If that's the case, that's okay. But I had I had internet issues today. Um, I put it out on Twitter. My main issue was just that the internet stopped working um, as I was going to go live. So sucks. <clears throat> Do we think that they are going to soak or not? Opponent snapped. If they full soak, they'll go up to 12 right. We'll be at 12 right. They win no matter what. That doesn't that doesn't work. Well, so we have Sandman out, which is great. But we don't we don't win. Yeah, okay. I feel a little a little vindicated. I was very afraid. Ms. Marvel doesn't work. Should have moved Jeff right. Screwed that up. How much energy did they save? Uh, I think it's it's not happening. Did we win by one? Victory. Dude! <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Dude! Holy cow. Uh, Tier, I I have not streamed on YouTube in a few weeks. I started off by two. Okay. Um, my quick math is bad. Just FYI. Um, I, I started off doing stuff on YouTube. And it just wasn't, it didn't feel right. Um, the, the 
streaming software, I don't know if it was that or if it was the internet or if it's just that the encoding for streaming stuff or whatever big words I could think of to use um, on, what do I want to get rid of? On YouTube, maybe it's just a little bit worse. Not, I'm not positive, I don't know. Um, but I just, I was having connectivity issues on YouTube. On Twitch, I have almost none. I have zero drop frames for the day. Any sort of hitches or hiccups, it's, oh wow, this is rough. It's purely from my um, CPU encoding stuff on with OBS not working perfectly because I don't have a good balance for it yet. Um, bot or high evo? I gotta go with bot at this point. That's my best guess. I don't like this setup though. Um, so we we would like for them to take Baxter Building, which they did. For me, it's between Doom and Magneto. I think Doom just for the across the board power at this point. As long as you can stream, uh, it's good. Play and have fun. Also make some money. Got a decent PC, I would also try. And it's challenging as your father. Yep. <laughs> it's, um, it's a tricky thing to do. I just, I, I do my best to enjoy um, whatever I can. Now. Nope, nope, nope. Ms. Marvel, Jeff right? Or do we just Eliath left? It's probably just this, right? It feels bad, but it also is probably a bot. <clears throat> Ms. Marvel Jeff feels safer to me for some reason. Yeah. I don't know what they're going to play, but I feel like this makes me feel better about what I'm doing with my life. And if they win, that's fine. Even if it's a bot, I don't care that much. Um, Ms. Marvel is classier. Hundred percent a bot. Okay, but with okay with bots though, if I snap on final turn, they run away, right? All right, and I don't think that this will actually hurt anybody. Maybe it will. Um, I want to go. I'm gonna go for another twenty minutes, but I need to run one minute of ads uh, in order to do that. So I'm gonna do that, and I'm gonna keep playing. Um, but most of you shouldn't get any ads, I don't think. So, I apologize if it happens, but uh, we're just going to do it for one minute. Mail Order Cowboy. Thank you for the follow. You didn't have any last time. Trey Busfu, your cheese. Stinky cheese. I, I, I gotcha. That's Eliath. That's the Eliath emote right there. Where's that from? Twitch Global Emote. Stinky Cheese is freaking Eliath. I'm in. All right. And even if people are in the middle of an ad, we're not going to make it that far into the game before they're here. So I'll just play slowly. Dude, Onslaught Citadel is everywhere too. Yeah, I... Uh-oh. That's not great. Well, I'd rather get rid of that, I think. At least at this exact moment. Asteroid M isn't terrible. Alright, ad should be done, and then we're good to finish out the stream. I 
I think we're going wave. Don't know what they're playing. Like, I, I know the gist behind what they're playing. But I don't actually know what we're up against here. Hmm. You know what, though? I wonder if... Okay. I'm assuming we're going to get a null in the left lane. Which is fine. Oops. <laughs> That's a bummer. Um, dude. I mean, it's going to go mid. Oh, it's Destroyer. I got you. Okay. Is it just a Lyoth left? I'm so confused. I feel like I'd rather just do Odin though. I'm just, I'm gonna do this. If they win, they win. I'd rather not be a jerk. We won. Victory. But if we didn't have that, if we didn't have that one doom, we would have lost. And if we would have played Eliath left, we also would have lost. So, I mean, there were other options, but Magneto left also didn't feel correct. So, oh, I didn't do this. He's gone, but also we're at 95. All right, let's check stats one more time. Hmm. All right, we're plus 76 cubes, 68.1% win rate, 49 and 21. Sounds good to me. I'd love to save Aunt Maze for Jeff if that's possible. If not, it'll be okay. That's such a bummer for their Black Knight. Hey, Jeff, there you go. Yeah, I feel like the deck's working. All right, it's not a bot. <laughs> I'm assuming this is a very normal person. That sucks! Ugh. We gotta play what we have, and we don't have much. We can't do Ms. Marvel mid anymore. I guess we could go Ms. Marvel on the right, if that seems best. Mmm! All right, Magneto is a proactive play. Proactive? Yeah, we'll go with that. Oh, it's not going to matter what we do. I think we're in trouble. Red Skull. Are they going to play their task or whatever they have left, or are they going to go mid? Probably left, right? Left, correct? <laughs> no, they already used Ant Maze.
Going mid. Got it. Got it. <clears throat> Victory. I'm such a scumbag. I'm so sorry. Oh, behaved. Welcome. Nothing's up. We're just ranking up, playing some Sandman. Hit 90. We're at 95. You could see all those things like on the screen. I'm just, I'm, I'm basically narrating my life for a moment. How are you doing? Don't like sand? I would, I would do the thing from Star Wars, but I don't remember all of it. Bit twiddle, go for it. Or anyone else in chat. I don't I don't remember. It gets it's sticky and gets in places or something. I think that's probably a direct quote from Star Wars. It's coarse and it gets in my flaps. That sounds right. <laughs> Is that Jar Jar who said that? I'm a Marvel database, not Star Wars. Okay. <laughs> Good to know. I know more about Star Wars than I do well, that's probably not true anymore. I feel like doing this has made it so that I know a little bit more. <laughs> Horse flaps. That's horrendous. Uh, yeah, let's do this. We're gonna need Odin. Doom. Probably just cards in general. <laughs> oh, we gave him Green Goblin. Nice. Can't complain about that. I could, but that'd be dumb. Um, Wave Scarlet Witch. We gotta hope that it's not the negative place, whatever that place is called. That's not it, so that's good. They have Infinite, good intel. They could have one of four cards. I know that we're going to pull Green Goblin. Never mind, we're not going to pull Green Goblin at all. <clears throat> no, not Peak. Sorry. Um, bar with no, bar with no name. Where you want to have negative power? All systems go. Right, their right is better than our right. Um, this and this. I think we, I think we bail. If they got our Eliath and they just play that left, we win, but I don't think that they're going to do that. I would hope that they wouldn't do that. They probably got a few big cards that they could lay. Yeah, bad call. Oh, blob, my bad. Oops. That's a bummer. That's a bummer right there. Oh well. I feel like I've done enough good today that I'm not super worried about a few dumb losses. I just don't, I don't think I've seen that before. I'm gonna work, I think when Beta Ray Bill comes out, I'm gonna work out some good Thor deck. Um, Cause I have to. I also gotta work on getting a good ink split for Thor. At some point. I think Beta Ray Bill is going to be super fun. It's just, it just feels like the season of, of big beefy characters. And I'm good with it. They have been pushing Thor lately. I, I think that Thor has some really cool variants. The Conquest Rewards one was absolutely wonderful. I freaking love it. If you couldn't tell. What are they going to do? Mm. 
Beta Ray Bill completes the Thor core. That's a weird sentence to say. <clears throat> Bit twiddle, as usual, I have no idea what that means. Is that a, a series? I know that Beta Ray Bill is like Thor's nemesis, arch enemy, his copy, his something. I don't know. I don't, you know what? I don't know anything uh, is what I'm trying to say. Um, is that like a good comic series? The Thor core? Please give me something good, right? I'm cloning bats is a thing. Oh, all right. That makes sense. Thorcor is any person who becomes worthy of the power of Thor. Please give me something good. I need Sandman really badly. Eliath is just going to be a waste, I feel like. <sighs> Golly. I don't like this round of Marvel Snap very much. I, I'm too in my own head at this exact moment. <clears throat> if we just soak that into Sunspot, hope that Eliath actually hits something useful. If they if they soak here, we definitely bail. Wait, are you saying I had a string of bad losses? Oh no. No, I think I I think it's just this is I I have a terrible string of cards to lay. And I don't have Sandman. So Oh yeah, cloning vats. What the heck am I doing? <clears throat> yeah. No, I I understand what you're saying. This looks like such a childish board right now. I don't understand exactly why, but I look at it and I'm like, oh man. There's just a lot of a lot of nonsense out here. How about we go? How about we retreat? In the most recent issue of Thor, he was fighting the old gods version of Thor and Summon Storm. Beta Ray Bill and Loki. They each threw Mjolnir to each other, giving them the power of Thor to defeat him. It was awesome. Heck yeah. I still, I gotta, <clears throat> I gotta read something. I gotta read some comic, graphic novel, anything. I just, I gotta do something. Uh, Guardiola611, hello to you and also good afternoon to you. Also, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Uh, I gotta look and see who's live as well. As we start to wind down, who? Shall we go see? Mm -hmm. Scrolling, scrolling. Hey, you guys take a look. If you guys have someone. Is BMAC on? Is he going on soon? Oh, heck yes. All right, BMAC's our dude. Let him know we're freaking coming. I love that guy. He's so great. Castle Blackstone, that is such a good hit for us. Hmm. Right, but this is a deck that we don't really want to give them. We don't want to give them wave, probably.
Hannah's Cat Cafe and Devilish. What is Hannah's Cat Cafe? I do hope that's a Marvel Snap streamer. Yeah, I was saying earlier that I, I kind of feel like I... Okay. Um, I feel like I have a lot of... Hannah's a German streamer for Snap, yeah. Okay, I'll, I will give her a follow. That's awesome. I had no idea. Um, mm, crap. Hold on. I'm losing my train of thought here a little bit. Ah, oh, we're in trouble. Get in there, Jeff. Save the day. I bet my father in law could find her. That's a good point. Yeah, her marketing is a little bit better than mine. Um, 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 um. crap. Do we want to go Magneto? Right? Or Magneto mid? They they could win this so easily though, right? Like there's no way. That we should leave because we've got this in the bag. Wait. What is happening? I don't think there's, we're not getting a better win, I don't think. That's my, uh, that's my personal current feeling. That's, that's beautiful. If you made it this far in the video, thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it. Make good choices. Remember, you're going to have a great day whether you know it or not. And as always, peace.